Hey mom, what is it Viley? Can we please go to Barnes and Noble booksellers today? No, but mom, no, but mom, Viley. How many times do I have to say this to you? I said no. If you want to read a book, go and read the books that you already have in your room. Please mom. I broke my all of my sweat and tears having to do chores for the past few days. You said that you would take me somewhere if I worked hard enough. Can we please go? Okay. Fair enough. We will go, but only if the books that you choose are appropriate for you. Thank you mum. I love you. You are the best. Brian, keep an eye on Jake here. Call a babysitter if you have to. Oh boy. I've been looking forward to this. I get it. Don't try to annoy me, or I'm turning the car back around. Okay mum. Yay. We have finally made it to Barnes & Noble booksellers. Hey mom. I would like to get this book. Are you serious Viley? What were the Twin Towers? You are way too young for books like that. They are only for mature readers, because they contain materials related to the September 11th attacks. So what? Some teens can read books like this? Let's search for something else. No way. I want what I want, so give it to me now. Viley. Stop acting like a spoiled brat. And look around you. Everyone is looking at us. You can either come with me down to the Dean's shelves, or you will get nothing from Barnes and Noble booksellers. You're kidding me, right? If I ever dare to bring an adult book to school or anywhere I go, everyone will tease me for reading so poorly at them. Too bad Viley. You can either come with me to a different aisle, or leave the store. You know what mum? If I can have what were the Twin Towers, nobody will. Viley, stop it, now. Excuse me, Mrs. Anderson? Is that your daughter Viley? Yes, Sarah West. I'm sorry for the disturbance. I'm sorry too, Mrs. Anderson. But I'm afraid I'm going to have to ask for the both of you to leave right now. For ripping out the pages of the unpaid book, you will be banned from this Barnes & Noble bookseller's location for three weeks. Get out of this store right now. That's it Viley. We're going straight back home right now. You're getting absolutely nothing at all. It's okay guys. Viley is going home for ripping this unpaid book called What Were the Twin Towers? Yes. We have to clean up this mess and replace the damaged book. I have to agree with my sister Hannah. No problem. And Viley is banned from this Barnes and Noble bookseller's location for three weeks. We better clean this up right now. Everyone, get this cleaning started. I will throw out the destroyed book in the garbage. A replacement copy should arrive in a few days. We have to get going. Unbelievable. You have barely learned to behave in a single store. You are so lucky that you didn't cause any destruction in there, because you would have been in a huge amount of trouble. But mom, I'm very, really, sorry. No. Apologies not accepted. You ripped apart the What Were the Twin Towers book in front of all those other people who were over there. One of those was literally 11 years old. Can we at least go back over to Barnes and Noble booksellers and get a different book, maybe Fifty Shades of Grey? No. We got kicked out of the store for what you have done. And you know what? You are not coming with any of us to another store. Just wait until your dad hears about this. Uh-oh. Not our naughty daughter again. It's hard to believe it, Brian. But it's true. Viley ripped pages out of the What Were the Twin Towers book that she was too young for. And we got banned from Barnes & Noble booksellers for three weeks. Oh my god, Viley. I can't believe that you threw a hissy fit at Barnes and Noble booksellers and ripped pages out of the What Were the Twin Towers book. You are too old to act like this. But mom and dad, 
I'm sorry. Cut that out right now. You know what you did at Barnes and Noble Booksellers. You should be really ashamed of yourself, young lady. That's it. You are grounded until your ban from Barnes and Noble Booksellers expires. There will be no TV, no video games, no computer, no restaurants, no rated R and NC-17 movies, no junk food, no activities that you like, no amusement parks, no water parks, no music, no vacations, no sports, no concerts, no family outings, and no other things. And you won't hang out with your friends like Kenwood, Shannon, Christo, Jahari, and Roman. I have to agree with your mother. Now go upstairs to your room right now. There are...